How do we become more aware of the nutritional regimes and healthy living practices enabling us to reach our goals? We can take control of our health and whatever else we would like to do through questioning the perceived wisdom of all the quick fix programs. Education has evolved over the years to become an arguable effective way to gain knowledge and being able to take control and guide you to whatever you wish to reach. What's important is that by putting the work in learning how it's done, then having that determination to see you succeed. The first step in deciding to start anything new is the hardest, and one of the reasons is hesitation in fear of failure. When it comes to commitment it's like a thermometer, the bigger the commitment the higher the fear. Let's lower that commitment to the smallest step you can take, such a commitment in taking control of your weight or any health issue, where you can start with the smallest step which is easier and more successful than the quick fix approach that so often fails. Starting with one action to remove many evils. What is it going to take for you to become incredibly healthy and to reach the weight you want to achieve? Goals and targets are great, but action steps are a must to reach and fulfill what you are aiming for. Having that extra weight or being obese can make you vulnerable to many other health issues such as type 2 diabetes, heart disease and many more. We can use all the fancy gadgets on the market that cost money or do work out in a gym to become sweaty and exhausted with little or no results in weight loss. In actual fact, this can even have a reverse effect in making you hungry and craving for more food. The most immediate action to lose weight is to cut down the meal size, nothing else will work more effective than eating less. This does not mean to change the food you like. You just cut that size of meal you ate in the past, and make these changes gradual at the beginning. If craving for food becomes an issue between meals be selective of what you have. Reach for some fruit or a handful of nuts, but don't stay hungry. Remember, this is a slow motion procedure, mind, stomach and body must have time to adjust. It is a natural way in losing weight, not a stomach band surgery or any quick fix magic. Lap band operations are not always successful or risk-free. About 1 in every 15,000 lap band patients dies from post-op complications. The most effective, natural and healthiest way to bring those kilos down is reducing and changing the food you put into your mouth without any excuses. After having reduced the main meals the next step is the in-between snacks, nibbles and drinks. To make it easier let's use the EOH slogan, that means, eat only half. That means to cut those in between snacks and drinks by half until you feel comfortable to replace them with healthier choices. As your weight is coming down there will be this feeling of change and gain of confidence, then slowly replace the bad food with the good. Certain daily diet actually determines your health. It is a known fact that the foods we love and eat every day can jump start to cause illness and even cancer. The food you eat is what really counts, and eating the wrong food does matter. Eating the wrong kind of food will suppress your immune system, that means the body's defense is no longer there and this creates the perfect environment for any illness and cancer to take hold. Avoid trans fats such as margarine, hydrogenated vegetable oils which are the true problem, not the animal fats. Trans fats are the culprits causing heart disease, type 2 diabetes and obesity. Processed food is known to contain fructose, salt and flavoring to give it taste and a longer shelf life, it becomes addictive from the highly refined sugars which causes metabolic dysfunction leading to overeating and uncontrollable weight gain. To control your weight trans fat and sugar are the ones to look out for, and we are not talking about that spoonful of sugar in your coffee or tea. It is that hidden sugar you can't see, the fructose artificial sugars that cause weight gain and other chronic diseases. This as well includes all soft drinks, coke, diet coke, power drinks, sport drinks and most concentrated fruit juices. Points to keep in mind, avoid sugar, fructose and processed foods. Add whole foods such as in Mediterranean diet. Our body needs animal-based omega-3 fats such as krill oil. Use butter instead of margarine and vegetable spread. Coconut oil is better for cooking and has more health benefits. Use olive oil for salad dressing and adding to food, it is not good for cooking because it has a lower heating point. Carbohydrates and sugars are the cause for weight gain and heart disease, not fat. More about food choices, also the best shake mix weight solution, and natural supplementation that has the ingredients of many healthy organic fruits and beneficial fats such as omega-3, 6 and 9 to add to your daily diet. If you have benefited from this video, please hit the like and subscribe button for future video. If you would like to lose weight, click the link in the description below to find out more.